tutorial i'm going to discuss on what is called a pio seal so a pio seal what is it in this case presentation i am going to discuss on a typical case study of a scrotal pio seal so this was actually a hemiscrotal pio seal a pio seal is actually a pyrrolate collection of fluid around the testicle in the potential space of the tunica vaginalis and it can be distinguished from a hydrosil by the presence of internal echoes consistent with debris, septations or loculations. So looking at this case scenario, you can actually see that what we are having here is this cystic lesion in the right hemiscrotum and as you can see there is this capsule that you are seeing here that is regular in defining this cystic collection however this is part of the hemiscrotal free fluid this is hydrocell but if you come here you can see that there are internal septations which you are seeing here these septations are consistent with a pyocyl. However, a hematocyl can also have got the same uh, sonographic features. So you can actually see this fishnet appearance in a hematocyl that will be consistent with what we call fibrine strands. Playing it again, you can actually see this is what was presenting or sonographically so again you can actually see the fishnet appearance and you can actually see the regular capsule uh, of this pyocyl so here what we have in here you can see that there are some internal echoes here and you can see the fishnet appearance nice septations here on Caladopla again you can see that there is no significant perfusion or there is no perfusion in the pyocyl. So the perfusion is actually noted uh, at the periphery. So peripherally that's where we are having perfusion. Otherwise this septated lesion has no perfusion. So using a different grayscale you can actually appreciate uh, the septations you can see the septations here and a little bit of some internal echoes which you are seeing here so this is actually characteristic of a pyrocell so you see the nice fishnet appearance and then we have our capsule here this is well outlined lesion in the right hemiscrotum so doing it this way again you can actually appreciate here this is a beautiful example of what i am referring to as a pyrocell so this is the same uh, pyrocell so you can actually see the fishnet appearance or these septations which are going all the way in the cystic lesion doing it this way again you can actually appreciate uh, the nice uh, septations here which are conferring this uh, cystic lesion the fishnet appearance or the spider web appearance as you can see you can actually see this and you can see the distinction uh, between the pyocyl and the hydrocyl which is here which I suppose is part of what is called the reactive hydrocell. So this pyocell can be a complication of a chronic inflammatory process that is taking place either on the testicle itself or in the epididymal region or on the spermatic cord or the scrotum as it were. I hope this is beneficial to you. Remember to subscribe to our channel. I thank you all from wherever you are in the world. Thank you so much. Have a blessed 
day or days ahead. Thank you.